Hello everyone, my name is Zenos Forever and welcome to Stealing the Diamond, the second part of our Henry Stickman saga. Uh, I know it's the third game of the series, but I combined uh, games one and two into one game, well, one video, so uh... <clears throat> Anyways, so, let's go! As the mayor, I hereby declare the Tunisian archaeological exhibit open. Twelve million dollars? Of course, Henry. Alright, so we're breaking into a museum. Um, hold on a second, I just want to make sure. Yeah, it's still recording, sorry. Just After the incident I had with Dark Souls 2, with Dark Souls Episode 2, I don't want my camera to just crash on me again. And, uh, but unlike Dark Souls, I can just restart this and just be extra pissed. Alright, so let's bust in! Oh! Motor It's a scooter with a motor. Oh crap! Um, uh, wait. Wow, you're after a great start! Hint, you have to- you gotta use your keyboard for this part. Ah, jeez. Alright, <clears throat> let's try this again, shall we? Let's, uh, kick- okay, jump! Oh! Jumping off a speeding vehicle may not be the best idea. Uh, okay, um... Let's try... Kick! <laughs> well, you got one of the guards. Okay, so that means Ram is the right answer, right? Ram! Boom! Whoa. What's with that uh, weird we pair? a breach headed towards the medieval section. Uh, roger that. We're preparing to engage over. Wait, we're ready to go. Uh oh, uh, let's see what we got. Uh, mate, you're the mate! Oh! <laughs> Good thing Janet just got done buffing those floors. Could you imagine all the germs you'd be rolling around in right now if they hadn't? Uh, also, I know I haven't shaved in a while, it's just I haven't had much time to record with, uh, the job I had. Had, I. I was working with a temp agency, so just, uh. Anyways, let's try again. Mate! Well, I'm gonna flail. Actually, that'll be a flail and stop hanging around and do something. Get it? Is, get it? Okay, I'll stop. You're not gonna stop, Buff Ball. Jousting time! Blam! Uh, jousting. It's harder than it looks. All right, this feels right here, right? Oh. Uh oh, um. Basket! Uh, oh. Ah, Torque. I bet you wish you paid more attention to physics class now, huh? Okay, just because they got a C in college physics. Two cables! On the elbow! And after that, they just stopped and arrested him. Whoa. Really? Yeah, that's when I decided I should probably get a job. Oh wait, that's job. the other car! I figured night one without garden, the mustache, the one that we didn't, uh... Dangerous than driving a... Crap. That's the other car, the one that we didn't have to testify against. Oh, um, uh, 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 branch! You're a shot! I can see all those hours of video game playing has really sharpened your reflexes. Oh, wait. Okay, the branch is right here, right? I mean, if we can buy some of the branch, that would be pretty cool. Branch! What are you doing? Whack them with the branch! <laughs> Wait. Uh, didn't really think that one through, did ya? Nope. No, we didn't. <clears throat> Alright, so rock. Oh, that's a girl. That's a girl in the bar. Oh, Officer down, repeat. Officer down. Sniper! Ah, oh, jeez! Uh, stay ready. Swipe your body ahead, wanker. That is a sniper reference. Uh, one of his taunts, I believe, is, uh, wave goodbye to your head, wanker. Uh, <laughs> you shouldn't even gotten out of bed. I don't play Team Fortress 2, but... Oh, come on! Alright, where's the rock? No, Johnny! Officer down, repeat, officer down! Ah, as opposed to solving an officer would get you an extra star when you're in that little minute. Alright, let's take the grenade to the I was gonna make a Devilman reference, but 
I always wondered how those things work. <laughs> Just with the stick. Isn't one of the demo man's weapons the sticky grenade launcher? Not one of you is gonna survive this! If, any Scot if I have any Scottish fans, I am so sorry. Rock! No, Johnny! Officer down, repeat, officer down! Alright, sniper, let's see how you like my pull! Go, 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 deal! You should have even gotten out of bed, sniper. That. Ah, Brick is out! Sir, place your hands where I can see them. Um. If you do not comply, I will be forced to fire upon you. You um, leave me no choice, sir. Wait, what? <laughs> Dude, do something! What? <laughs> okay, let's try this again. Sir, place your hands where I can see- Bribe! Huh? Bribery is a federal offense, sir. Strange, that usually works. Sir, place your hands right. Try driving. I don't think you're gonna get very far that way. Well then. Sir, place your hands where I can see the diamond. Well, damn. <sighs> hey, we did it! You won the aggressive way. Woo! <laughs> He's hugging the diamond. <laughs> well, we did win, Henry, so... So, let's return to the start. Alright, so this time let's sneak in. I think we've exhausted all the options for uh, busting in, so... Let's see how the liquid liquidificator does. Turn yourself, turn yourself into a liquid and bend your molecules around or through any object. Fantastically easy to use. Gadget game, 2010. No, Ravel code is not, re is not responsible for any misspelled words or words used in the wrong context. Oh. What did you think was gonna happen? Yeah. Alright, shrink ray! Honey, I shrunk myself! More. Man, worms are so much more vicious up close. I think that's supposed to be like a worms reference. I I've never played worms, but um. <clears throat> but anyways, um, that reminded me of the Thresher Mall. You know that I was panicking about and had quite a few expletives to say about it. <laughs> uh, it was from Mass Effect. So let's try the pick. Creeper. Yeah. So apparently there's something in that cake, and uh, he used it to escape. Oh! Pretty lame, huh? Yeah, I don't really like this. Uh, please shut up. Oh, I just, I was, I was just trying to have a conversation, you know. Since I mean, we're partners, so I just, just wanted to get, get to know each other a little bit, hmm. you know. I just want to hear what they say. I just kind of wanted to have a conversation. Oh, it just loops. Bombshell. Ah! <laughs> Why would you think they keep live bombs in a museum? That's a good question. What the hell is wrong with me? Yeah, so apparently there's something in that cake, and uh, he used it to escape. And then I got fired. Pretty lame, huh? Yeah, I don't really like this. Uh, please shut up. Oh, I just. I just All right. Kind of let's go with the M. Let's go with the machine gun. What? <laughs> Quick, pretend you were joking. That's not gonna help. World War Two guns. Wait, is that yeah, World War so One or World War Two? There's something in that cake, and uh, he used it to escape, and then I got fired. Pretty lame, huh? Yeah, I don't really like this. Uh, please <sighs> shut up. Oh, I, just, I, just, I really hate this beard. I don't know how my dad does it. Play. Uh, I gotta warn some. All right, so. Uh oh, oh. Nope. Let's try this way. Nope. Hmm, must be a light sleeper. Well, that sucks. Let's try that again, huh? Oh, 
Uh. Eh. What was the shot? Okay, come on. Oh, so he's gonna wake up either way if I click that. Okay, so. Oh, the diamond is. There we go. Okay, so what we got? And there are a couple of guards there. Metroid, crowbar, Pokeball, Super Mushroom. Let's see how a Metroid does. I've never played Metroid. Hopefully it doesn't go badly. It's eating my brain! Looks like they don't take kindly to orders. Uh, I think that would be funny if I actually played Metroid. Um, oh well. <clears throat> Let's try the crowbar! What was that? Headcrab? Headcrab! <laughs> <laughs> Why does that always happen? I've never played Half-Life. Uh, it was before my time. Definitely way before my time. Um, I think when the first Half-Life came out, I was like, um... Sorry, just, I, I was trying to make it look, sound like, uh, you know, boom, 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 you know, when it drops in a... Anyways, I, I think the original Half-Life came out when I was still in kindergarten, maybe? Anyways, let's try the Pokeball! Come on, bring out someone useful! Ooh, it's a Gen 3 reference! The Ike Guards, Tim and Joe, would like to battle. Tim and Joe, send out Joe! Go! Not missing, no! Oh, you idiot! Why would you use missing, no! Oh, they crashed! Oh my god, missing, no? Why? Oh, I can't read binary. Uh, if anyone can read binary, or maybe in editing, I'll <laughs> look at the retry. <laughs> Anyways, um, when I when and my cousin told me about missing no in uh back when uh, red was still was still a big game, you know Pokemon Red and Blue back when they were still really big, like brand new essentially. Um, he told me about missing no, and then told me that it was a glitch that could damage my game. I was terrified of that, so I tried my best to avoid getting Missing No at all costs. Uh, I think I read somewhere that Missing No was supposed to be like a placeholder for a split evolution between a, between Cubone and Kangaskhan. Like, there's something between them. It never came to light, but uh, it's probably just a rumor anyways. Super Mushroom! I am Bulletproof! How did the thing still hack up all these years? How did I not break the diamond? Oh, hit with a cannonball! Oh, this is insane! Oh, the pillar fell! Somewhere in the south, in the west, center of the chaos containment. Uh, sir, you might want to come look um, at this. Unable to locate card 66. That's a dish reference. Ten point six. It's coming from the museum. My god. It's over nine? A <laughs> Dragon Ball reference. Yeah. I'm leaving this decision up to you, Corporal. Just hit one of those buttons to deal with this pressing situation. Uh. Who's watching TV? Get back to work! <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, the, um, it's over nine is reference to Dragon Ball's over 9,000. I think that's supposed to be, like, Goku's power level. Uh, but anyways, let's see, um... But I think the whole uh, pressing situation thing, I think that's mostly like a CSI Miami gag, so. Satellite! I'm firing my laser! <laughs> really, Puff Balls? You had to do an I'm a fire in my laser gag? Who even? Dom Farah! God damn it, Dom Farah! If you guys haven't seen the Red Laser Collection, uh, you can find it on YouTube. Um, it's kind of like Tomska's Astiff movie, but um, I personally prefer Astiff movie, actually. I mean, the whole uh, Dr. Octagonopus thing is kind of gets old after a little while. It's kind of like the, uh, it's kind of like that uh, episode of Monty Python where they ended every, ep where they supposedly ended every sketch with the fuzz showing up. Or oh, the no non the no news news the no nonsense lieutenant. Hang on a sec. Okay, still recording. Sorry about that. Um, <clears throat> just have to make sure I'm still recording. Divide by zero. How is this gonna? Oh, wait a sec. Dividing by zero is undefined. Leet. Wait. Uh. Oh, come on! 
Sorry, I went to the bathroom. Where, wait, but I meant, wait, where, where is everyone? Uh, sorry, Puffball. Honestly, this is completely against everything I stand for, but gift drop! Cancellation, Special Agent Deck Nuke. I think that's mostly like a Call of Duty reference, but uh, I've never played Call of Duty. Well, not seriously. One, I don't really care much for shooters. Two, well, that's mainly the reason. It's too that, and it's way too mainstream at this point, and it's just dumbed down to casualty. It's just way too casual for me. I suppose I prefer games that prefer that require actual skill, like uh. Wait, what the hell am I talking about? I have no skill! Ow, my pride! <laughs> Alright, so, um, let's try this again, shall we? Mega, mo Mega Monster! What the hell? How is that not glad to fucking chaos? <laughs> it's a giant bloody robot! It looks like one of the Power Rangers! And we have to leave the diamond behind. Run, Henry, run! Wait, that sounded like uh, that uh, little uh, what? Sounded like something you got a melt your solid. Jeez! I suppose that the destroy music to contain the chaos. Right! We did this. It's on my hands. Oh my God! Yes! You won the epic way! Woo! Yeah! Sorry, just, uh... I'm sorry, but just, um... That just... That just makes you feel epic, I think. So, let's return to the start, then. Right, so this time we're going in from the top. Stay from the top, shall we? Jumble Hoppers! I have no idea what this is from. Uh oh. Well, pfft. sweet flip, bro. And the gravity cap! You're lucky, I've always wanted to go to space. Uh Space, space, Ray Lakes, the space. That's so cool. Um wait, where'd the cap go? <laughs> Teleporter. Let's hope it works this time. No firing range! Oh, it's the only thing left, so. Uh. Yay, we did it! Yes! Honestly, I don't really play as Captain Falcon that much. I usually play as, like, a swordsman like, uh, Link. Uh, lately I've also been giving, uh, well, I don't really play Smash Bros. as much as I used to, but I used to play as a swordsman every time. Uh, let's, I usually go with, um, I usually go with Link, like I said. Toon Link and Young Link are okay, but, uh, but I also do like playing as Corrin in, uh, at, uh, in the, uh, Wii U version when, uh, they're playing it at Fusion Club. Um... <clears throat> Sorry, I just want to check my camera's angle. Okay, so this is usually this it's the same angle it's usually at. Okay, sorry, just uh Anyways, um <clears throat> But anyways Punch! Falcon! 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 Punch! Punch! Oh <laughs> Only one man is capable of the Falcon Punch. Well I suppose we could try fire bending. <laughs> we try okay, let's try the Trank! How did you miss? Whoa, what are the odds of that? And we're going right into the fan. Head puree. Invisibility pill. It's hard to see when you're invisible now. I suppose it would be. I mean, you're, uh... I mean, to be invisible, you have to divert light from your eye. You have to divert light from all around you, so... Your eyes well, aren't getting any light, so... 
You can't see anything. It's pretty clever, Fit Puffballs. Ah! Alright, let's try the penny. Lucky number one! Ah, yeah, look, a penny. Ah, well then. Alright, let's try... Portal Gun! Why didn't you portal yourself, moron? I mean, seriously. Wow, that's 4.23 gigawatts. Wow, that's uh. Okay, so. So we're still maintaining a speed that is appropriate. The external plastic casing on the portal gun is constructed of a high pump. Um, I'm sure he pulled that from, uh, I'm pretty sure he pulled that from, like, Portal or something. Uh, I mean, it's obviously a Portal reference, but, um, just trying to think. Um, <clears throat> but why don't we just create a hole in the portal at the bottom of the wall, a portal next to us, and then just, uh, jump through, and then just jump through the portal, come down there, and break the, and steal the diamond. Let's drop down. How high up were we? Did you really think that was gonna work? I was kind of hoping it would. All right, the wire then. I'm like a bungee jump. Laser cutter. Ah! What the hell? You get cut? Why you no bleed? Answer. Yeah, I know. The lasers are cauterized. I mean, lasers would. I'd be, I mean, assuming the. I'm assuming the laser would be extremely hot, so it would cauterize. It would burn at us the second we it cuts us, so it would cauterize the wound. Like, uh, you know how in Star Wars, or it's like, uh, Episode 5, when, uh, Luke's arm got cut off? Um, uh, I don't remember how far it was. Let's just say, his, he didn't bleed because his wound was cauterized immediately. Same thing happened to his father in, um, uh, Attack of the Clones. The reason I bring up Attack of the Clones, I know that people don't like the prequel trilogy, but that's, but Attack of the Clones is the first Star Wars movie I saw, so please don't be mad at me. It's all that was out at the time. I was six years old when it came out. Hammer! This is gonna make a lot of noise, though. What the hell?! <laughs> I mean, really? What the... <laughs> Alright, let's try... Jeez! Maybe it'll be a... Stink bomb? Sorry, my... Uh... Why? Seriously? I was kind of hoping the cheese was a trick. Like, we get it, and it... Of course, that's the one thing that works like it should. Kenny! Uh-oh. No, 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 no! Uh, ow! You almost saved it. Almost. All right, let's try this again, shall we? Plank. Boy, and after that, like a they just opened a rash to them. Like a diving board. Ready? Yeah. All right. So he had a smoke break, so let's. All right, let's try snapping his neck from above. What? <laughs> you had my neck? I told you, man. I told you on the stairs. I don't get the reference, but it just. Oh man. Let's try jumping over him. <laughs> I'm surprised you made it that far with that heavy diamond. Fair point. All right, rifle. That's actually that actually looks more like a shotgun than a rifle, just based on the uh, pump. With a rifle, you usually have like um, you either have you usually have like a lever action, a bolt action, or a break. Or, it just uh, and then you've also got the clip, so. Man, those first-person shooters make it look so easy. Well, for one, he's holding it wrong. He's holding it at his... My dad taught me how to shoot a shotgun when I was... Uh... How old was I? I think I was like... I think I was like 14, maybe? No, 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 that was... I think that's when he was... I think that's when he taught me how to uh, drive standard. But, um... With a sh but anyways, he was holding it in his shoulder. That's a bad idea. You want to hold it on your... Sh not his shoulder, his elbow. He's holding it in his elbow. You want to hold it on your shoulder and, uh... 
But I'm just going with a shotgun, but I don't know how you work with assault rifles because that is way beyond my pay grade. Nope. That and I also don't like guns in general, so let's just drop the diamond. <laughs> it's like the bowling ball from the last episode. You won the undetected way. Woo! And buy a yacht with it. <laughs> Stop at an arcade. I really need those. Hey, Sydney, I still haven't gotten a cane yet. Just, whoa, geez. That is fancy looking. Well, we are rolling in the money. But anyways, that's the end of uh, Stealing the Diamond, so... <clears throat> what time is it anyways? My sister is actually home, home but she's at the movies with her friends. Oh Christ, she's probably gonna be back soon. So, thank you all so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please click the like button down below. And as always, I'll see you next time. Until then, live long and prosper, and I'll be damn cheap.